the world has a ravenous appetite for energy. Our need for it grows exponentially every year as the global population expands. Production of it is not the only issue. The greater challenge lies in transporting and distributing it to meet growing demand as the world becomes more developed. In order to solve these and other critical issues facing society, the IDIC was formed. Its goal is to bring together two of the strongest innovation ecosystems in the world, the Dutch and Israeli. Five years ago, Rakeli of the IDIC saw the Dutch's rapid developments in the Hydrogen Valley's regions alongside their expertise in building electrolyzers. She realized that utilizing these capabilities to produce green hydrogen at scale would be impossible due to Dutch climate limitations, while Israel, with its amazing climate and green infrastructure, was running into issues in storing and transporting the green energy they produced. She realized there was a tremendous collaborative opportunity. The IDIC set brought together Israel's largest energy producers and energy consumers to understand their needs and plans for the coming years. Then they reached out to the leading local startups, innovating the next level of energy production and storage, to understand what resources they needed to make their innovations come to market. Armed with this knowledge, the IDIC approached the leading Dutch manufacturers and hydrogen experts to create partnership opportunities in this 150 billion euros market. Utilizing Dutch knowledge and expertise to modernize Israeli seaports for the transport of hydrogen globally. Converting Israel's fuel and gas pipeline to hydrogen. Thereby opening up the vast deserts of the Middle East and the capital of the Gulf nations to create hydrogen and transport it affordably to Europe without environmental concerns. Creating hydrogen valleys powered by new heat engines developed jointly with VDL capable of producing 30,000 to 50,000 tons of hydrogen with a potential capacity of over 1,000 megawatts of power. Excess hydrogen would be stored or used by commercial vehicles or sold to local fuel stations for use in their soon-to-be-deployed hydrogen gas stations locally. Infrastructure projects of this kind can help move hydrogen production from the kilowatt level to the gigawatt level helping the Netherlands solidify its leading role in deploying mega-projects of this size. Through the knowledge and innovation gained from this process, CapEx costs will be reduced going forward, enabling further more cost-effective deployments around the world in places like Morocco, Namibia and Chile. Established companies alongside Dutch startups all stand to benefit substantially from these efforts, all the while providing Dutch investors the opportunity to finance these lucrative projects. The innovation opportunities created by IDIC go far beyond just power plants. It will include green energy storage facilities, transport and even development, as well as repurposing of existing infrastructure. On the back of this will come the development of new industries focused on the development of hydrogen-powered cars, trucks, buses, boats and planes. As a result, these modest steps between two small countries will have an exponentially large global impact. Not only will they move the world closer to net zero by 2050, they will create entirely new ecosystems and supply chains, positioning both Israel and the Netherlands in leadership roles able to capitalize on these developments.